The city of Crosby will soon begin construction of their city runoff project to improve water quality in Serpent Lake. Sarah Winkleman has more. The water quality of Serpent Lake has been continuing to decrease over the years due to added phosphorus levels that in turn create algae. Anything from leaves, debris, diapers, uh, plastic, all has been going straight into the lake with no treatment. Currently, any water is going into this drain through the underground pipe and straight into Serpent Lake. We're happy that they're diverting some of this wastewater that accumulates in the streets and our yards and then it eventually goes through our yard and dumps into Serpent Lake, which we're not happy about. The outdated pipe was originally installed back in the early 1900s. They were built before there were any ordinances or requirements by the, the state to um, regulate uh, these kind of activities. Beginning next week, construction crews will replace the road and some driveways along 2nd Street to put in place a new filtration system. So now we're going to be channeling the water down uh, towards the city hall to a series of uh, rain gardens, what we call rain gardens, where there's depression in the ground where the water is able to filtrate and get clean before it gets to the lake. Construction is expected to last a month or two, but neighbors like Nancy say the outcome will outweigh the inconvenience. It's something we've waited for and we're, our family is happy about it, I know that. Once the project is complete, the lake will be healthier and able to be enjoyed for many years to come. Reporting in Crosby, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. The project is being funded by a $1.2 million grant from the Clean Water, Land and Legacy Amendment. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.